Welcome to our weekly reflections on the Psalms. Today we reflect on Psalm 128 with the theme Prayer Networks for Presence. As a recap, our reflections in the section starting with Psalm 120 begins with the letter P, illustrating our continuing theme that the psalmist is a pilgrim attempting to network with other pilgrims and discovers the different aspects of spirituality Psalm 128 continues the theme of Psalm 127 family work and community as priority areas in our lives In Psalm 128 the psalmist begins with the essential question we constantly ask how do we understand God's blessings or what does it mean to be blessed The psalmist begins with the verse Blessed is everyone who fears the Lord who walks in his ways Some translations translate blessed as happy In the Old Testament blessed is the term regularly used to describe a person who is in a good situation The Hebrew word does not mean that God blesses or rewards such a person rather it means that such a person is happy the psalmist indicates that one of the most important ways we celebrate this blessing is to experience god's presence god's presence is a blessing that we all can experience in one of the most profound teachings of jesus in the sermon on the mount or the be attitudes it is the same word that is used to be blessed is not coincidental or to be lucky but intentional in the sight of god generally we say it's a lucky day or by chance instead the psalmist invites us to state that we are blessed we are blessed because we experience the presence of god continually god's blessing enhances and enriches our lives in our family work and community the psalmist expression of fruit of the labor of fruitful vine or olive shoots are metaphors of the blessing of god god's blessings make our lives complete In verses 5 to 6 because Zion is the place of the presence the pilgrims bring the needs and hopes of everyday life with them Zion represents a place of blessing the apostle Paul echoes a similar experience in Jesus Christ in Ephesians chapter 1 verse 3 blessed be the god and father of our lord Jesus Christ who has blessed us in Christ and every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places to be blessed at home work and community is to experience the presence of god which is a blessing from god in the words of frank crane here is a poem titled beauty of a house the beauty of a house is harmony the security of a house is loyalty the joy of a house is love the plenty of a house is in children the rule of a house is service the comfort of a house is god himself let us pray loving god we thank you for the mystery of your will revealed in jesus christ we thank you for in christ we have also obtained an inheritance having been destined according to god's purposes which is fulfilled at home work and community for god's glory we pray in the name of the one who is the presence of god jesus christ our lord amen god bless you